Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier and in this particular video, I am going to discuss how you can deal with categorical data null value. Okay, like here in the purchased column, in this particular cell, no null, no value is present. So this is null value. Okay, now how you can handle this? See, you cannot apply the algorithm used for removing the null value present in numerical data. Because that time in case of numerical data, there was a chance to take the mean. Okay, but in case of categorical data, we cannot do that. It is not possible to have mean of string data type, right? So how to do that? The idea is quite simple. We will replace the particular null values by mode of the column. Okay, because mode is what? The uh, highest frequency element. Okay, the element which is appearing highest that is mode, right? So there is a huge probability that, that the same element who, for which frequency is highest will be placed here, okay? So we'll be doing that. Let us go to MATLAB. First import the data. I will be going to desktop and I will be taking data 2.csv file and I will import this here. You can see here null value is present, okay? So I will just click on this green color tick button and here if I write data 2, I will be having my data set. And remember this, although in case of the numerical data, the null values are shown as NAN, not a number. Same thing if you are considering in case of categorical data, it is defined as undefined. Okay, now let's calculate the mode of the data set. Okay, so data 2 dot purchased okay now if i run i'll be having no all right now you may think in case of mean we have to give one more argument that is omit none but here in case of mode you no need to give because if you check the documentation of mode this same link i'll be posting in the description box okay here if you go down okay here you can see Input arguments NAN that is not a number or NAT not a time values in the input array A are ignored. They by default they ignore. Undefined values in categorical arrays are similar to NAN in the numerical array. Just now I have told you that undefined values in categorical array are same like none for numerical array, right? So we no need to give this omit none. All right. So now we have calculated the mode. Now we have to replace those. So what I will be doing? data 2 dot purchased equal to data 2 dot purchased and this will be under fill machine same function as we have used for what as we have used for numerical data null value removal and here we need to give what I have told you constant okay then comma then e okay now e is categorical data here you cannot directly place categorical data if you run you will be getting error okay see fill missing and what the error says fill constant must be a string a string array a character row vector or a cell array of character row vectors okay you cannot give categorical data so just type cast that so i will convert cell array okay that is last one cell array of character row vectors you can do cells str i'll be writing and clicking enter now if i check my data sorry data 2 i'll be getting see here now no null value is present in which column actually our null value was present from the bottom 1 2 3 4 5 6 in case of germany 40000 here null value was present right and here you can see in case of germany 40000 the null value which is undefined is replaced by the mode of the column, right? So this is how we can handle the categorical data null value, okay? Do this kind of pre-processing, then only whatever machine learning model you will train using your data will have high accuracy. Otherwise, accuracy will decrease by a huge amount, okay? This is all for my this video. If you find this video helpful, please like, share and comment. Subscribe our channel if you have not subscribed till now and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of our latest videos. Thank you.